Well, we, we never like going up there because the bus ride in the college station just takes so long. And uh, uh, I, I remember that trip, you know, like it was yesterday because it, it was raining and, you know, the uh, hotel wasn't like we wanted it. And we were all mad <laughs> because we were all locked in and it was raining. And it was just one of those dreary, uh, I guess, Friday, Friday afternoons when we got in. But the next day was good and, uh, you know, uh, it was a wonderful, you know, wonderful day, if you remember. This will be a 17-yard field goal attempt. In is Ray Tarasi, the senior from Pittsburgh. 13 seconds to go. The snap is hot. The spot is Well, uh, you know, uh, I've, I've told this story a million times, and, you know, my ankle being uh, the way it was, I was in and out of the game a whole lot that time, uh, that, that game. And that series, I, I think I came out two plays right before that or a play before it. And um, when Willie tackled Blair, uh, you know, Blair at the, um, at the entry out line, we, we, we knew we were going with desperation block. That's when Mike Ramil and myself uh, – uh, uh, George Thornton and you know Steve Webb, all that's uh, you know taller guys came in to and then to get a push. My thing was to push a hole so that Mike Ramil would go through it and, and and make a block. You know and you know if you ever watch the video, you see me looking around, looking around, seeing who's coming in the game. You know, you know counting, you know looking up in the stands. You know we had about 500 people from Alabama. We could see right there in that right corner. And, and, and believe it or not, I've met a lot of those people throughout, <laughs> throughout the last couple of years. And uh, we, we, we couldn't, you know, the guys were like, no, nah, man, it, we had come too far. You know, watching the center, center guards heads down, not looking at me, not paying attention. Uh, ball was snapped, and um, I took a whole man. Uh, and I didn't just try and create a gap. I took a whole man, and I drove him back, you know, far enough to get up. I really didn't get up. I don't have I don't have like a 36 inch vertical or anything. But you know the penetration that I got, you know, was good enough to get the block. You know, Blair Thomas was was uh, a running back that we knew that would run the ball really hard. Run, would run the ball right down your throat. Uh, hard nosed players. Uh, um, they all were. You know, we always knew that Penn State was going to come out with one of the best uh, ground attacks. Uh, uh, that we had seen, you know, so far, you know, we, we being undefeated at the time, you know, and uh, being a, a, a big blue collar team, we knew we had our hands full with, with Blair Thomas and their offensive line. Uh, the, the, it, it's, it's totally different now. I mean, media has taken it and I mean, it, it's phenomenal now. I mean, kids get to see and uh, get seen by, by schools all over the world. But back in that day, uh, the, I mean, it wasn't that long ago, 86, 85, 86, is, uh, the, mail, the mail was big and, and the phone calls were, were a lot. You didn't have text messages or you could, you know, you didn't have emails or anything like that. So you got bombarded with a lot of phone calls. Being a big recruit, I got a lot of phone calls. I got a lot, a lot of mail. And uh, the process of, 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 of choosing a, a school was, you know, was much, much more difficult because you didn't get to see, you didn't, you, you didn't get to pull it up on the email or, or on the internet and find out what goes on at this university or what's at this other campus or anything like that. So you made choices based on, you know, uh, on gut feeling sometimes or, 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 your, or your favorite team. You know, me being a boy from the South, I wanted to stay in the South. I, I, I knew I wasn't going to follow my brother's footsteps or, and, and, and go to Notre Dame or anything out, uh, out you know, in the North. Or anywhere out west, you know, being you know southern bred, I, I wanted to stay in the south. Uh, so my choices really came down between you know Florida State actually, and uh, and, and Alabama, uh, Miami, those three schools. And I, I had gone to Oklahoma, I had gone down to um, uh, uh, Florida, and I've, I'd seen a lot of universities. But you know, I, I tell a lot of folk they uh, they let me come to Alabama last, <laughs> and uh, that, I, I think that's where everybody messed up. Uh, my kids and I love to go to Dreamland, 
And I said, the, the, the day that I sat in dreamland and I ate about four or five slabs of ribs, I knew where I was going. <laughs>